I'm Milton Glazer and I'm a graphic designer. I loved to draw when I was five years old. I've never lost the idea that you can have something in your mind and make it physical and material that exists. So the transformation of an idea into reality is something I found the most compelling single thing in my life. And as it happens, the, the world of design seemed to be susceptible to that interest. All my projects mean something to me personally. The work that I did in the 60s and 70s where I was kind of trying to epitomize the quality of that time in record albums and book jackets and the kind of drawing that was of that period interested me. I must say the best work I've ever done, the work that came out of interest in the work, not out of a professional assignment. Uh, but I've done too many works to isolate a few. And I'm not individually concerned about the pieces as I am about the process, about the idea of moving from one thing to another and how one thing yields to another and how things change before your eyes. That's one of the secrets of communication, is to create an entity that's slightly puzzling, but not so puzzling you can't solve it. So everybody goes through the experience of trying to figure out they can, and after they do, they feel satisfied and you get closure. That's a kind of rudimentary idea about communication theory. You know, in design, you're supposed to go f first by arriving at a conclusion and then working towards it by uh, sort of narrowing the opportunities to understand it. But my process is very different. It's very random. It's starting the trip without knowing where you're going and just wandering aimlessly until the path reveals itself. It's a different notion. It's closer to what happens when you paint than when you do design in most cases. The role of the graphic artist today is the role of a good citizen, as far as I'm concerned, which is that you participate in the life of your times and try to improve the existing condition. You don't exploit anyone, you don't force people to do things they don't want or encourage them to do things that are not good for them. Which is why, for instance, I'm not in the world of advertising, selling products to people that don't need it or causes harm. Trying to sell people a bottle of soda is as dangerous as giving them an armed weapon.